The Vegas odds for the Detroit Lions season wins total on the upcoming season is trending at eight right now, and we like the over on that number. The Lions' schedule last season is similar to the one that they're going to face this year. Their schedule in 2014 was ranked 16th toughest in the league, and this season, and this season they reach a ranking of 15. They've still got a beast in Calvin Johnson at receiver. Matt Stafford is a pretty solid QB. My only concern here is that they lost that key component, Ndamukong Su, who was a huge reason this team ranked second best defense in the nation last season. And there's no replacing Su. I mean, you can't just replace a guy who single-handedly can change up an opponent's offensive game plan. That's why he was able to break records when he made his move over to Miami. But I like their new pickups as well. I mean, they traded for Haloti Nada, who was a big key in the Ravens Super Bowl championship three years ago. Uh, they also have a new secret weapon with Tyrone Walker. Now, Walker is an under-the-radar kind of player, but the Lions aren't the only ones who liked him in the offseason. The Patriots also tried to pick him up. Uh, he could be an outside player who can deliver the pass rush while still solidifying Detroit's run defense. Now, if those two guys can still pick up the slack that Sue left behind, I think they can push at least nine wins in the season. Now, looking at their schedule, we see losses against Peyton Manning and his Denver Broncos in Week 3, the Seattle Seahawks in Week 4, then a loss to the Arizona Cardinals on the short week there at Week 5. Uh, then I also see losses here to the Green Bay Packers in Week 10 and then again in Week 13. Then there's a few toss-ups for me on this schedule. Again, because I'm just not sure there's some question marks hanging over the Lions defense Week 8 in London, when they see Kansas City, I think that game could really swing either way. Week 12 against the Philadelphia Eagles, because I'm also very, uh, I have a lot of question marks in my mind right now with that team as well. And then Week 14 against the St. Louis Rams. So that all adds up to the Lions going 8-8 eight and eight this season, but that just doesn't feel right. They impressed us all big time last season, and I don't want to underestimate this team and take the under here, so... I'm taking the over for the Detroit Lions on the 2015-16 season.